there's a settlement occurring. So shit that would settle Monday will have a deferral. But the shit that settles Monday, we don't really care about, right? We care about the things that settle on those on those OPEX dates. So when that OPEX settlement is deferred, that's a big deal. Um, but like this is just like weekly obligations. There's really nothing happening at this point of the month. So even if it is deferred, it's not going to be a very big deal. Moon Man, happy fourth. Take a breather. Thank you so much, dude. I appreciate it, guys. Happy 4th to everyone. I hope you all have a great weekend. Um, today's price action, just, you know, following the trend in the market for the most part. I think we had a little higher than usual FTDs um, from May 25th, but not significant. Uh, so, like, maybe over 100000 but nothing, nothing to really affect the price. And, you know, we saw... We saw like a small bump with CNS closing and into power hour. Uh, this this volume at the end of the day is kind of curious, but probably just more clearing of obligations while they had a little like closing liquidity. Um, out here on the longer time frame, it still just looks like we're grinding into that resistance. So we've recovered a little bit. If the spy moves back down, I expect they will then use some short equity and try to try to bring us back down through this resistance but really we just keep testing it um this is grinding out options in the near term so be very aware of that if you buy options make sure that you have plenty of theta that any price improvement you see will offset the decay um overall though i mean it still looks like we're pushing down there's nothing nothing's changed that looks bullish at least in the near term um for the SPY, kind of the same deal. Uh, it's still just kind of locked up, consolidating. I don't know which way it's going to break. The Fed meeting's coming next week. This could easily chop all the way into that, um, especially with, you know, if there's just a lot of uncertainty on buy and sell side. No one really wants to do anything, right? So we're just hitting a period of stagnation after we had this little, you know, bear rally. Um, I don't think this looks particularly bullish either. It's got so much hard resistance to the upside and hard resistance to the downside that something's going to need to come in to get it moving again, um, one way or the other. Thanks, Gerg. Thanks, Kenneth. I appreciate it, dude. All right, guys. Uh, happy 4th. Uh, members only stream Sunday, 12.30 p.m., I guess. Um Maybe I'll do it a little later for the West Coasters. Let's say two o'clock. How's that? We'll do Sunday, two o'clock um, Eastern time. Let the pores in, please. For what? We don't have shit coming up this week. Fine. Whatever. Is anybody not a member at this point? <laughs> I'll think about it. If I let the pores in, I'll let them know. I'll tell you guys on the Discord. <laughs> Ultra pores unite. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Have a good one.